Hey YouTube, it's Patrick here. Um, I wanted to do a video on the our toxic society and how toxic it really, how toxic it really is, um, without us really even knowing how bad that it really is. The reason I did, I want to do this video. <sighs> excuse me while I catch my breath. I've been um, kind of deep in the woods, and I got to get out of here before it gets dark and shoot this video. But anyway, um, the other night, me and my family were up watching a movie, and. Um, they were spraying for mosquitoes, and it was like this giant um, super soaker attached to a 4x4, four four, and they're spraying away and spraying away. And I just thought it was weird, they're spraying on grass that's already treated with chemicals, where a lot of mosquitoes don't live, um, and most of this pesticide was falling on the concrete. And it just got me to thinking, that in this documentary that I watched, um, which is Canada's Toxic Valley um, on Vice, um, Vice is a really good channel, I highly rec recommend um, subscribing to it just from the carbon monoxide it's from your car um, if you if you start your car and don't open your garage so eventually you're gonna, you're gonna die from the chemicals yet we live next to highways I do um, I'm trying to move um, but the, you know the, the rush hour traffic or anything like that living next to a highway there's lots of extra uh, toxins that you absorb <sighs> speaking of mosquitoes um, also the heavy metals in your deodorant, um, in your shampoo, there's aluminum in your deodorant, um, your toothpaste has fluoride, your tap water has fluoride, chlorine, all these other um, chemicals that your body has to treat, that your body has to not only treat but filter. Um, the BPA in plastics, the BPA in receipts um, that you get at the store, cleaning chemicals, uh, smoke, secondhand smoke. We were at the fair the other day and we went next to the beer tent and you know me and my family had, were basically like sitting in a bar with all the secondhand smoke when, as soon as the wind shifted. Also GMO plants, it's the pesticides built right in. Um, pesticides, herbicides, if you don't buy or eat all organic um, you're going to be consuming these um, heavy metals and these plastics and oils that are make up the, the pesticides. Flu shots, um, vaccinations, of course, um, plenty of chemicals in those directly into your bloodstream. Um, we have, if you have fillings, we have mercury in your fillings. Um, makeup and medication, if you have any kind of anything from Advil to um, Prozac, has got um, these chemicals and, and whatnot. So, what can you do? You could try to detox. There's a lot of um, you know, there's easy way to detox and the hard way. Uh, the best way, or the cheapest way, would be just to stop eating or, or trying to take in as many toxins as you can and drink plenty of water. Um, they say juicing is really good. I've been also reading this book called The Gerson Therapy, and that's basically how they remove, they, they claim to remove cancer from body by removing um, all uh, chemicals from the diet. And then it's basically flushing it with juice. Um, that's one way to detox. Um, that's how I'm currently trying to detox. Uh, my body is by juicing and of course eating all organic and trying to stay from any extra chemicals that I can. So that would lead to my next video which is detoxify your body. Um, but that's all I have right now. Um, I hope this video made you uh, at least think a little and um, I'll see you on YouTube.